Eric faces the Giants now for only the second time in his career. Well, welcome back, Eric Fetty. Last outing was on May 16th. So right on time at 2.05, here comes the first one. And swinging and singling is Lamont Wade. The University of Maryland product goes out to center where Andrew Stevenson is playing today. That'll bring up Mike Yastrzemski. Two balls and two strikes. Fetty delivers and a swing and a miss struck him out with a cut fastball at 90 miles an hour. Well, here's the cutter up. Yeah, a little wander swirl action on that one. Here comes the guy who's the key to the Giants lineup right now, Buster Posey. 2 2. Nats looking for a grounder. Instead, it's a changeup. And Eric Fetty had Buster Posey way out in front. 2 down. Now the Nats are in a shift for Brandon Belt. On 3 and 2. There goes Ray at the pitch. And it's in there. Strike three called on a cutter. Locks up Brandon Belt. And the side retired. It has been a while since. Gosman was last out on the mound one week ago today. And there's a long one to right by a leadoff man with power. See you later. Dwarver lands in section 239 with plenty of room to spare. This is what Davey Martinez was looking for out of the leadoff spot today by sliding Kyle Schwarber up to the first. The absolute bomb. First three nationals have reached base safely against Gosman. Josh Bell. Switch hitter. The pitch is hit on the ground to second. Flores has it. Flips to second one. Crawford to first. Double play on the play. Turner goes to third. Josh Bell hit that pretty hard, but right into the defense for the double play ball. Two down. One two pitch is swung on a miss. Strike three. The splitter got him. Posey reaches out and tags Harrison. Gosman gets his first strikeout. So Gosman to face Starling Castro. Here's the pitch from Gosman. It is swung on and missed strike three. Got him with the split finger pitch. Out number one. Second strikeout in a row for Gosman. That one got by Buster Posey. In time. Nice bit of footwork there by Brandon Belt. Shifting from one foot to the other to get the throw and keep the foot in the bag. Kevin Gosman. He does have four hits for the year. That's a base hit to left field. Such that's a really really good at bat work the count work the count saw some off speed pitches got some pitches out of Fetty and gets jam just enough but gets enough barrel on it to just dump it out in the left field here is Yastrzemski with the tying run Gosman at second fair ball pouncing Avila Ooh, high throw Josh Bell had to put his tippy toes up on the bag good thing he's a tall first baseman check swing and it's off the wrist of Bell time to recover Mr. Posey not able to get down the line quickly enough and Josh Bell kept his wits about him the pitcher did his job and the Nats are out of the inning Kyle Schwarber who launched a big home run to lead off for the Nats on one the count that's deep to right field Yastrzemski at the wall not this time out off the end of the bat on that off speed pitch. Husband's 1 2 pitch. Here it is. And it's popped up behind first. Belt ranging over into foul ground, and he's underneath it to make the catch. That is out number three. Very good inning for Kevin Gosman. It'll be Brandon Belt leading off the frame. Swing and a miss on the cutter. Eric Fetty with an effective cut fastball to some lefties today. Yeah, and the last time he had a strikeout was against Brandon Belt. Here's Brandon Crawford, the 2 2. Swing and a miss. Struck him out with a cutter to the inside. So that has been Fetty's strikeout pitch this inning to the left handed batters. Bottom of the fourth. Bell bats here with no outs and one on. Let's see if he goes with the splitter now. 1 2. He does, and he struck him out swinging. Great arm action, the dive on that pitch. It's just by the time you recognize it, those are the swings you end up seeing out of it. So here's Harrison. Josh struck out his first time up. Harrison hits one a ton the other way. This one heading for the track. And it short hops the wall. It checks up. Soto coming around. He will score easily. And Josh Harrison, opposite field, puts the Nats up by two. Great swing by Josh Harrison. I said he was not going to wait around for another splitter from Kevin Gossman. Jumped on this fastball out over the plate. Went with the pitch. And as you mentioned before, Bob, the sun's starting to come out a little bit. And you see. Yastrzemski kind of pull up on that as that ball went into the sun a little bit to not allow him to make the catch there. Juan Soto hustling all the way around. Love to see it. So here's Talkman, left-handed batter facing Fetty. Swing and a miss. 
couple of nasty curveballs to a left handed batter took the air out of those swings. Number six for Eric Fetty. Well, Mike Talkman, a little sword action here with this half swing. Definitely wasn't anticipating that breaking ball, but six strikeouts now for Eric Fetty. Steven Duggar, 0 for 2 career against Fetty. 2 2. Swing and a miss on the curveball. Eric Fetty had all of his weapons working today. Seven strikeouts. He's going to get a nice ovation on his way to the dugout. Nance on top, 2 0. Six outs to get. First three of those, the responsibility of Kyle Finnegan. The right fielder, Mike Yastrzemski. With the shift on, it's 1 and 2. And again, Yastrzemski the other way. This would be close down there. In Andrew Stevenson with enough room to make the grab. Huge out with Buster Posey coming up. And Posey will drop one into right center to extend his hitting streak to six games. Buster, 12 for 26. Buster pulled his hands on the inside of this elevated sinker. The only reason why that ball stayed up in the air is because it started up. So two out, runner at first. Swing and a miss. He struck him out with a 97 mile an hour fastball. And the side retired Bell has struck out all three times to the plate. Right hand is coming on, trying to close out game one of this day night split day age with the score of the Nationals two and the Giants nothing. Swing and a miss on a big breaking ball. The patented Brad Hand slider starts behind the left handed batters. And they're just not able to stay on it. You see Crawford well out in front of that one as he was reaching, trying to foul it off. Wilmer Flores with a homer and two RBIs against Brad Hand career. Two for six. He'll go the other way. Juan Soto is there, two down on a one pitch out. Outfielder Austin Slater from the right side. And he's going to get a cold third strike with it to end the game, which will take about two hours and 10 minutes. And now the Nats return the shutout favor to the Giants.